So you're working from home and if you've been following these uh, videos linearly, uh, you'll have built up a little bit of a structure, a little bit of uh, a process. You'll be training in the morning, you're beginning to find yourself. And here comes a tricky bit. If you're working from home, you're still working alone. And that's really clearly not going to work. And I will explain why. If you were at work, if you're in a workplace environment, whether you like it or not, you're going to connect with those people around you. You're going to exchange ideas, views, gossip, opinions, and all those things are the external world enriching your own internal world. And although you may have an internet connection, which obviously is an essential, it is not enough to enrich our internal world. We still need the distilled opinion and ideas of other people, both from a cognitive health point of view and from a cognitive enrichment point of view, as in factually enriching our idea and um, uh, concept of how the external world actually works. Which is why connectivity with others is really important when you're working alone. Although you may be working in an isolated environment, you may be isolated yourself, it is important to find your tribe, to use whatever digital means are at your disposal, to actually connect with people you care about, with people you actually um, uh, admire and want to learn more from, with people who you actually um, want to sort of uh, interact with and engage and exchange opinions and ideas the way pretty much the same way that you would in the, in the real world in an offline kind of um, situation. How you do it, of course, is up to you, but it has to be done and you'll be better off for it. I hope this helps.